Hi, Colin Kirkland is my name from Bermad Water Technologies. The purpose of this brief video demonstration is to discuss the design, the features and the benefits of the Bermad 100 series control valves used in field valve applications in the irrigation industry. The history of this product is that more than 10 years ago, there were many non-metallic control valves used in irrigation applications which tended to have a limited design life and some inherent flaws. And the purpose of this demonstration is to highlight the 100 series of valves and how it overcame many of those issues. A very unique design aspect of the Bermad 100 series valve is the fact that it's a very long stroking valve. What we mean by that Typically, valves will only open about 25 to 30 percent of the valve diameter. This valve will stroke more than twice that. The effect that this has in the valve design is that when the valve is fully opened, the flow path is almost completely unobstructed. Now, this has an enormous uh, a benefit to designers because the flow capability through the 100 series valve is huge with very little, if any, head loss. So when designing a system that requires very low head loss conditions, the Bermad 100 series valve is very unique in its design to make it compatible for most irrigation systems. The first aspect of the Bermad 100 series valve is about the general design of the valve itself. It's manufactured from glass reinforced nylon, not polypropylene or PVC, which gives it immense mechanical strength. In over 10 years of this product being in the market, we haven't experienced one failure of the valve body through torque loadings or stress being applied to the valve. In addition to that, it is designed for outdoor use. It has UV stabilization within the valve too as well. So uh, as importantly, being a mechanically strong valve, it's lightweight and easy to maneuver and to change its position in the paddock too. So that's the overall Bermad 100 series design of the body. The main challenges which manufacturers have in manufacturing a control valve in a non-metallic material to operate is to get a valve that has mechanical strength and the combination of flexibility in the diaphragm in order for the valve to operate in a wide variety of pressure conditions. Bermad with the 100 series valve, do it with one diaphragm assembly. Now importantly, how do they do it? Well, they made the diaphragm assembly at the top here very flexible that it's able to roll and move uh, inside the valve body, but they made it joining to an actuator assembly made of glass-filled nylon, and this is where we have the mechanical strength. So the combination of the th light, flexible diaphragm and the actuator assembly is a perfect combination to make it suitable for an irrigation valve. Now, as you can see on the circumference of the actuator, we have these guides here too as well, which ensure that the actuator can only move in one plane, so it's guided by the valve body and it simply slides in and out with no distortion or twisting to the side. What's the end result? The 100 series valve has a diaphragm and actuator assembly designed for the long run to give you amazing performance and stability through a wide range of pressures. An important feature of any control valve is its ability to regulate. So, if you have a control valve in the paddock, which is designed to reduce the pressure going to drip line or sprinklers, or to switch on and off with an automated control system, the ability for the valve to regulate is critical. A common application in market gardens or in typical irrigation applications is, you may have a, a block where you're irrigating sprinklers at about 600 kPa, where you might be using sprinklers. But right adjacent to that block, you may decide to put, say, for example, leaks in. And the leaks may be irrigated using drip tape that are required to operate at 100 kPa. Now, most irrigation valves cannot deal with high differential pressures because the valves are basically, they don't have the mechanical strength and the flexibility to do it. The Bermad 100 series valve is ideal for this application. We can have exceptionally high differential pressure conditions, six to one, seven to one reduction ratios. We can operate at a wide variety of flows within the range with zero effects of cavitation and zero effects of diaphragm deformation because the valve diaphragm is guided inside the body. 
So the, the result is that you will get a valve which will last for the long term without deformation of the diaphragm. Bermad pride themselves in being innovators in design when it comes to control valves. And one of the things that they did with the Bermad 100 series was make the valve enormously flexible when you come to install a valve in the field. Like many other manufacturers, the valves are available with a threaded connection in BSP and female. They're available with a flange connection. But nobody ever manufactured a valve that has the combination of a flange connection and a threaded connection in the one valve. Now, as I'm showing you here in this 100 series T valve, I have a 100 millimeter flange in the bottom coming into the valve. I have the water coming out, going out through a 80 millimeter flange, or I have the option of a 80 millimeter thread. Now, why is this of use to you? Well, in many irrigation installations, you generally have the main line coming up to the control valves in a large diameter pipe to minimize the losses, and subsequently may have 100 millimeter pipe at the bottom here. And you may decide to go out to the submains, you may decide to go out to the submains in 80 millimeter. So instead of having reducing tapers, etc., you can incorporate all this into the valve itself. The amazing result with this is is that when you're designing an irrigation system, you want to be cost effective and you want to minimize the possibility of leakage. By incorporating all this into the valve body and not external fittings is a reduced cost saving and also gives great flexibility to your design when you're incorporating this in a, an irrigation system. To manufacture a range of injection molded plastic valves is a huge expense. And Bermad today have a huge family of valves with more than 100 different configurations of these control valves to meet your irrigation needs. The valves start at 40 millimeter in size in a threaded connection and go all the way through to 150 millimeter in size. They're available with uh, either a thread and or a flange or in some configurations, we even have rolled grooved connections. With over 100 different combinations of valves in the range, there's bound to be a valve that can meet the needs and requirements of your irrigation design. There you have it, the Bermad 100 series valve for irrigation applications. With over 10 years field valve experience, with over 100 combinations of different models and setups, there's bound to be a Bermad 100 series valve to meet your next irrigation design. Should you require further information, go to your nearest Bermad State Sales Office, see us on the web at bermad.com.au or visit us on our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.